hardest part for my crews is to actually make that decision whether to fly out of altitude or to go back home and not make the mission complete. And we're sitting on about 200 feet of ice right now. But we just came from Christchurch, New Zealand, which is our forward operating base to support the National Science Foundation in Operation Deep Freeze. We flew about five and a half hours south to McMurdo Ice Station in here, which is Pegasus Runway, which is built on basically Ross Ice Shelf. So right now, our job is to come in and pick up about 100 scientists that, that stayed late in the season, about an extra six weeks, and they were down here doing research in the dry valleys, climate change, global warming, figure out science in Antarctica. Well, the biggest thing, obviously, is the cold. You come down here, the aircraft obviously can take it. It's been tested to do it. The other thing is the long logistic line. We're actually about 24 to 36 hours from any parts getting to Christchurch. And then if we were to break here, those parts would have to find their way down to us. So it's about a 48-hour long-term logistical chain if we were to break. This particular mission is very, very important because this aircraft can go from Christchurch land, offload its cargo of 100,000 pounds, and get back to Christchurch without taking any fuel out of here. But that's where we make the money. We get down here with a good airplane, get the mission done, and get back to Christchurch safely, we're good to go.